Hi Prep B, Hi Prep W, Mr Broadbent here for another read aloud. Remember our learning focus currently at the moment is monitoring and self-correcting, so we're still looking at that uh, today when we are completing our reading tasks and doing reading at all times. So uh, our new book that we're reading today is called Bear in Long Underwear. I have read a book to you before that has talked about uh, a bear in underwear. This one's a little bit different though, because it says bear in long underwear. So I wonder what that is going to be about. Hmm. I've made a few predictions myself. Let's see if we are right as we go. It looks like there's some snow in the background here. Okay. And he's got some earmuffs on and a beanie and you know, and some ear, um, and some gloves. So you normally wear those things when it isn't cold and you can see that he's Got on some underwear there and it looks like a bit longer because it goes all the way up to his arms. Hmm, let's see what it's about as we go. It's a snowy, blowy winter day. Mmm, cocoa. Yummy. Who's got the marshmallows? Bear and his friends are inside drinking hot chocolate. Bear is feeling cosy, but a little cooped up from being inside all day. He looks out the window and says, The snow has stopped falling. Who wants to go outside and play in the snow? I do, I do. Me too, me too. Everyone bundles up. They put on hats, earmuffs, mittens, scarves, jackets and boots. Hmm, very important to put all those on to stay nice and warm. Bear's friends rush outside, ready to play. Last one out is a rotten egg. I love rotten eggs. Hmm, of course the, the skunk could say that. Everyone wants to do something different. I'm going to find pine cones. Rabbit and skunk find sleds and head for the top of the hill. Whee! Last one down is a smelly sock. Beaver makes snow angels with cougar. Mine's perfect. Then they catch snowflakes. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Tastes snowy. Turtle and Hedgie have a snowball fight. Ouch! Let's help Hedgie. Okay, I've got my snowballs ready. Honey Bear and Deer join in the fun. Bear decides to build a snowman. Everyone has ideas for Bear. You call that a snowman? He looks cold. Yeah, he needs clothes. Oh gosh, everyone's giving him feedback. Bear agrees. He puts his own hat on the snowman. He needs more. He then adds his scarf. More. Bear puts his earmuffs. He still looks cold. His mittens. Give him your jacket. And then his jacket's on the snowman. The snowman is dressed, but Bear is nearly bare. Cougar asks Bear what he is wearing. This is my long underwear, Bear explained. I always wear this when it is cold and snowy. You look super cool and comfy and warm. Does it come in my size? Haven't you ever seen long underwear? Where can I get a pair? Everyone wants underwear just like Bear. Bear says there's lots more in the cabin. Oh gosh, they're all running off to the cabin. Make mine extra large. Are there any in pink? Mine are carrot colour. How do I put these on? Not sure these will fit over my antlers. 
Oh, this is fuzzy. Everyone picks a pair. Neato, spiffy, cozy, cute. There's one pair left. Look, everyone has long underwear, but there's one extra red pair. Who doesn't have long underwear? I have mine. I love mine. I got the green ones. Just right. Got mine. Me too. We're all good. I know who needs this pair. Oh, do you guys have an idea who's going to get that pair? I think I do. Snowman looks great in his long underwear. Super cool. Super warm. It is the perfect winter pair. And that is the end of our book today in Bear in Long Underwear. What a great little book. Okay, it is important to stay warm during our winter and colder times. Lucky we're going into some warmer weather now, which is fantastic. But you might have to rug up and put on some, maybe some long underwear to stay nice and warm. But that is the end of our book today in Bear in Long Underwear. Hopefully you've enjoyed it today, Prep B and Prep W. And I cannot wait to read another read aloud with you very, very soon. See you later, Prep B and Prep W.